I'm not gonna see me today but since I was blogging I'm in the office right now so since I was blogging I wanted to come and give y'all this exclusive straight from the AT y'all know I'm trying to get better about being a little bit more you know engaging on YouTube so I was like let me go I'm gonna give the YouTube people this tea first <laughs> I'm gonna give the YouTube tea people this tea first honey Yes, you know, it's straight from the A. It is straight from the A. Yes, Rose, Rose Lee Ann finally made a live. Yes, hit this like button if you like it. If you don't, hit the dislike button. Honey. Hit the dislike button. But this tea, I don't think nobody else got this tea yet. I don't know. I don't know if anybody got this tea yet, this exclusive super trailer straight from we tv <laughs> i don't know if anyone has this trailer yet y'all it's a whole bunch of people joining it's a whole bunch of people joining we tv marriage boot camp the hip-hop edition it's a whole bunch of people on there a whole bunch of people you never would have thought about we got waka flocka and tammy we got Lil Mo and her husband Carl. We got Soldier Boy and Nia Riley. We got Jessica Dime and her husband Sean Williams. Or is it? Oh, her fiance. My bad. Her baby daddy slash fiance. And there is Little Fizz and Tiffany Campbell. This is an exclusive, straight from the A T spill. Just for the squad members. Just for the squad. These are the new cast members. And I also got, honey, I got a press release. I got a super trailer. And we all going to watch it together before I write this up. I'm going to let y'all share this with me. So in the, in the um, let me turn this, this little music down a little bit. But in the um, press release, basically it just says, you know, this season some of the biggest names in hip hop are moving under one roof to put the relationships to the test in the glamorous world where business is mixed with pleasure and exotic temptations and knock are knocking on every door. A lifestyle in the fast lane can be both a blessing and a curse. Soldier boy and Nia Riley are, uh, cranking up the heat with issues beyond repair. Um, Rapper Waka Flocka and his wife Tammy Rivera may look like everything's all Gucci, but salacious rumors of infidelity say otherwise. It's make a break for hip hop superwoman, aka Lil Mo, and her husband, boxer Carl Dargan. Uh, allegedly, Carl has been unfaithful in their marriage while Mo, the breadwinner, is ready to put all the side chicks on full blast. Meanwhile, for Love & Hip Hop Atlanta star Jessica Dime and her fiancé basketball player Sean Williams, boot camp is their final resort. Sean has put a ring on it, but they've yet to set a wedding date in two years. Reuniting for the first time in months, we got Little Fizz of B2K and Tiffany Campbell from Love & Hip Hop Hollywood. They're making a last-ditch effort to reignite the spark before love completely fizzles out. But Tiffany isn't the only ex <laughs> that Fizz will bump, bump, bump into. That's so corny. But I didn't write that. The publicist did. So, you know, meanwhile, you know, we got the doctors, the same old doctors on here. I'm like, who? I'm looking at the cast. I'm like, who all is married? Let me see. Hold on. Let me. Who all is married on here? We got Lil Mo and Carl. Okay, they're married. And then we have um, Waka Flocka and Tammy. They're married. But Jessica and Sean are engaged. Okay, but they just had a baby. We got Nia and Soulja Boy. They've been together for a minute. I'm, you know, I didn't watch Love and Hip Hop Hollywood, but you know, they they they've been together for quite some time. And uh, what was the last one? Lil Fizz and Tiffany. Okay, okay, there he is. So you know, is this something that y'all would be 
interested in, in watching. Yeah, these couples fight it out over their side chicks, over their issues, over all the people that they've been allegedly, you know, cheating with over the years. I don't know. Like, I guess it'll be a little bit interesting to watch. But let's get into this super trailer real quick, y'all. Hold on. Again, this is a straight from the A original super trailer. Let me put the super trailer in. What y'all say? You saying nope, not a trailer. <laughs> but you got to give the people a chance now. You got to give the people a chance. Y'all can't just be watching the same old, same old stuff. Y'all just can't stay on YouTube forever. We got to be open to at least, you know, watching something different. Something different, honey. Hold on. This it. This it right here. Get ready to drop the mic. Oh! Ten days, one house, five hip hop. Right into it. Get ready to drop the mic. Oh! Ten days, one house, five hip hop superstars. Girl, I love you like a blunt and some Hennessy. Every single couple here is from the same industry, same community, same culture. This house about to be so lit. They live their lives in the spotlight. Are you outgrowing Nia? Oh. Man, our biggest thing is our and our ego. And in denial. I don't live off of nobody. What do you want, a trophy? Surrounded by temptation, their hiding problems have threatened their relationships. I like to see a future with him. I kind of just push people out of my life. You disrespecting me. He not about to grow up in 10 days. Because we of the ghetto don't mean we have the act of it. In the hardcore world of hip hop. People are accusing Waka of cheating. The stakes are high. They don't know how inconsistent your ass is. Yo, shut the up. Don't try and kill yourself this time, okay? And the emotions run. I just felt like I gave up. Even higher. This is stress blunt. Cow, cow, boy. They better check themselves. You FaceTime another woman in front of 27 cameras. And I can't stand a liar. Before they wreck themselves. Yo, the f call me? I'm not worrying about you going anywhere. You should be worried. I hope you find whatever you're looking for. It's over. Marriage Boot Camp Hip Hop Edition premieres Thursday, January 10th at 10, only on WE TV. So, what y'all think? Y'all think that's something y'all would give a try or no? Somebody said, nope, not even a little, not even a little bit. He said, isn't Lil Mo in law school? I don't know. Is she? Is she moving past? I don't know. But it's looking a little bit interesting. Like at the end of it all, after the end of these 10 days in a house, you know, somebody going to either decide to stay or leave. I don't know. <laughs> Like, no, no, hell no, hell no. They're going to one year. Okay, they need money, so more games. You over it. Sex and disease. Why should anyone get married if they're going to cheat? I think it should be black people in a very bad light. Really? Hmm. I can't take Latoya's husband bringing his every other tooth uncle for her mama. What? I'm confused about that. It's more men in the A. The pickings are Chicago's crackheads. Whoa, Royalty Leo. Whoa. People gonna get enough of that, of playing with their relationship on TV? Well, I mean, all of these people, each and every one of them have been on a reality show of some kind. Um, Soldier Boy and Lil Fizz and all of them, they were on uh, Love and Hip Hop Hollywood. You know, Waka and Tammy were on Love and Hip Hop um Atlanta, Jessica Dime on Love and Hip Hop Atlanta, Lil Mo was on R&B Divas. So at the end of the day, like all of them have been, you know, have been on something, but I guess they're all in it to win it. They all trying to figure out, you know, what they going to do, how they going to make their next move. Remember Benzino and all of them were on it too. It's like every single couple. It's like, I don't know, is boot camp where all these couples go to die? Like what, what goes on, you know, after they leave love and hip hop or after they leave, look, uh, RB divas or the Braxton's or, you know, uh, basketball wives, all of them end up over on the boot camp. I, I don't know what's going on on boot camp. But, uh, you know, they came with the fresher approach, I guess. 
I guess, a hip-hop approach. You know, they got all the hip-hop heads. I guess Soldier Boy and Walker and Lil Fizz, they gonna be over there, you know, smoking weed, getting their mind right and stuff. So, I, you know, I don't know. You said she was also on, on Love and Hip Hop NY. Ex well, yeah, she's been on several shows. Lil Bo been on a couple of shows. So, Lil Fizz couldn't get money. <laughs> but isn't Monique just his baby mama? Isn't she with a woman right now? Like, I don't, I don't know what that situation is either but anyway you guys i just wanted to come through really quickly and drop this dime for y'all with the little trailer so if y'all like it like it if y'all don't don't but let me know down in the comment section what do you think of this selection of people for um love and hip-hop i mean not love and hip-hop lord see that's where my head is at right now for marriage boot camp what do you think about Soldier Boy and Nia Riley? What do you think about Waka Flocka and Tammy and Jessica and Sean and Lil Mo and Carl? Like, they got five whole couples on here, and some of these people are really, really married in real life. Some of these people have real things going on in real life, babies and all of that jazz. So they're really together, but will they really be breaking up after this situation is over? Or will they, you know, are they just here for a check? I don't know. I don't know. Let me know what y'all think about it. See what y'all saying in these comments section. Said tired and through. Mm, yeah, yeah. I'm I'm prone to agree with you on that one. I am prone to agree with you on that one. So you guys, I appreciate each and every one of you for tuning in. I will probably be back a little bit later and we can actually have somewhat of a call-in session. So thank you guys for tuning in for this little short impromptu straight from the A exclusive trailer, super trailer viewing party. I will see y'all a little bit later. Bye squad.